All right, so I'm gonna continue the story, the main story, the Archon Quest. Um, taking a view outside of Leo Harbor and collect your thoughts. I mean, after what happened with our brother, I mean, we have to, we have to, you know, do so. Hello, guys. Yeah, it's it's amazing how this story was super compelling. Uh, without a shadow of a doubt. Okay, there you go. Get to get destroyed. If possible, get destroyed. I need some. Okay, okay. So now you're gonna get destroyed. And why? Because I have the ultimate, but also because uh, I'm on, on better ground, I guess. RT? Come on, dude! There you go. Okay. Alright. So now we can continue on this. Um, yeah, after what happened to with our brother, you know, you, you kind of have to guess that we're kind of... You know, in shock. Because we found him, but... You know, at what cost, I guess, knowing that he's our enemy now. Where do we have to take in the view, huh? Like, how far are we going? Hmm, maybe we don't have to... To go up all the way. Yeah, we don't have to. Okay. Oh, it was here. I just didn't notice the, the waypoint. Hello. Mm. Weird walking animation, to be honest, but alright. Um, are you okay? Simon never imagined your brother would have sided with the Abyss. I, I'm feeling a bit better, I guess, is something that I can well, say. I just, like, we have to that. figure things out. I'm Mm. And when the going gets tough, the tough get going, right? There must be more than this uh, that means the eye, yeah. He said we needed to reach the end of our journey. Paimon bets he still has lots more to tell us. Mm -hmm. And we won't find out what this journey is or where it will end unless we keep going. Thank you, Paimon. Uh, don't mention it, partner. Mm. <laughs> are I still don't trust you, though. Feel like you're kind of weird, but yeah. Where should we go next? If we want to continue with the journey... I still need to find that god. Oh, you mean the god that took your brother away in the first place? Yeah. You're right. After all, everything that followed, all this confusion, it all started with her. I need answers from her. I need to teach her a lesson she wants for me. I need answers. Yeah. Paimon bets she's the key to understanding this whole mystery. Well... We've ruled out two gods so far, the Animo and Geo Archons. So, next... Let's go to Inazuma. Hmm. Paimon doesn't think we can simply walk into Inazuma. Zhang Li said it was a closed nation. We'll have to find some other way in. <gasps> Why don't we ask someone from Inazuma how to gain entrance? Let me try and think on someone. Oh, Paimon spotted someone already. Atsuko, in Lia Harbor. She's from Inazuma! Really? Let's see what she has to say! Alright, so apparently we do know somebody from Inazuma, huh? Okay. Alright, let's go. Okay, there's a quest right there, but you know, we'll pick it up later. Let's continue with the main one. Mm -hmm.
All right. Yo, my dude. Oh, hello. Oh, uh, I mean, good fortune. Right? <laughs> I'm still learning to talk like a local. <laughs> Is there anything I can help you with? We wanted to ask, how do we get into Inazuma? Oh, so that's why you're here. Well, there is a way. Hmm. Great! We came to the right person! But the chance of success is incredibly small. Hmm. Huh. Incredibly small? Then how did you get out of Inazuma in the first place? Yeah. It was in leaving Inazuma that I found out just how dangerous this method truly was. All I had to rely on was a little wooden raft that I'd put together myself. There was a storm raging ahead of me, and my pursuers were close on my tail. Jeez. After I'd escaped their clutches, I floated on the open ocean for, I don't know how many days. My rations and fresh water supplies soon ran out, and I remember getting to the point where I was sure I'd reached the end. Then, I blacked out. But, to my surprise, my journey didn't end there. Or to put it another way, a new beginning found me. Did someone from Leeway save you? Ah, that's right. Okay. I escaped by the skin of my teeth. The fact that I'm even alive to tell the tale must be a sign that the gods were watching over me. Hmm. What a horrible journey! <laughs> and you set off knowing how dangerous it was? Why? Well, because everything is just too restrictive over there. The atmosphere is so stifling. The Kanjo Commission subjects everyone leaving or entering the nation to a protracted approval process, and I felt like I didn't belong there. All right. Kanjo Commission? Reminds What's me a lot that? of, you know, Row 96. Along with the other two commissions, they oversee everything in Inazuma. We usually collectively refer to them as the Tri Commission. I suppose they're equivalent to the eight trades under the Liyue Chising. Hmm. One of the obligations of the Kanjo Commission is to conduct rigorous identity checks on all individuals leaving or entering in Azuma. All non-nationals are processed centrally on Rito upon arrival. Meanwhile, the Tenryo Commission is responsible for implementing the recently promulgated Vision Hunt Decree. They act like the executive arm of the Raiden Shogun's rule. Loyal, yet unfeeling. It doesn't feel good to speak ill of my home like this. But after spending so long under that oppressive atmosphere, I begin to lose all hope for the future. What I mean to say is, unless you have an extremely compelling reason to go to Inazuma, you should abandon your plans of trying to get there. There are answers to questions I must know there. <sighs> you should know that the sea around Inazuma is engulfed in a perpetual tempest of wind and rain. Hmm. Supposing you survive that, you would still need to get past the samurai guards that enforce the Sakoku Decree, the closed nation policy of Inazuma. And even if you did manage to find a way, you'd still have to produce the necessary documentation at the Rito Center for There's always bureaucracy in this game, huh? Otherwise, Incredible. you'd be kicked out immediately. Seems like they really don't want anyone setting foot in Inazuma, huh? But they have reached you, yeah. They only set that up as a port to guarantee a supply of goods and information to the island. Most outlanders would be unable to. Supposedly, Nazuma is based in Japan. But if you really are. But it feels going, like they are portraying it way too, you, you know, try. restrictive. I don't know if there's a part of history in Japan that I'm missing. Probably there is. But yeah. It seems like they are. Well, not, I don't know if it makes any sense. Maybe I'm, I'm, you could ask you know, tripping, the but fleet if they have some way of getting you to Inazuma, it feels like they're pouring this type of. Uh, may, maybe it is. I don't know why I'm being like. Maybe I'm sure that it is controversial, but they are putting like this idea of how restrictive actually China is within uh, Inazuma, which is meant to represent Japan. <laughs> Is up to you. So that's interesting, but yeah. Beto, then the hardest part will be out of the way. Uh, let's give it a shot. The Alcor is the flagship of the Crux fleet. Beto. I heard that it's. I, I mentioned it as Beto. Beto. Damn it. This might be your but yeah, chance. you know they're like, oh, you know, no so oppressive and and so on. But whatever. Let's go, Beto. It's Beto. 
Oh shit, this all the way there, huh? Okay, let's go. Map. And okay, so we have to come through here. Teleport. Okay, we have to find a way to go through these islands to get to where we want to get. Can I avoid those those helicos? I mean, I will, I will have a lot of uh, fun just avoiding them, to be honest. I also have to defeat the Geo Hypostasis eventually on single player, which is gonna be hell, but you know, we have to try it. Yeah, they can go in the right direction. Mm -hmm. Okay, be careful not do not jump uh, into the water without full stamina. Okay, now go. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's enemies, you know. All over the place, so I don't think we're gonna be able to avoid them uh, much longer. But yeah, yeah, I know you guys. It's all good. It's all good. It's all great. I don't want to fight you. Mm-hmm. I don't know if this is the way, by the way. Mm, probably not. Also, I'm stuck. Okay, thank you. I mean, I can always walk on water if I get the ultimate on Uncle Kami. This is Wade. Hold on. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Now go. Okay, somebody died, I think. Okay. I feel like I'm not doing the right thing, by the way. By going through here. I feel like it's obvious that this has nothing to do with... How uh, we have to get to to be uh, to Beiru. Uh but also like if we continue this way, we're gonna die. So hold on. I don't know what they're doing over there. Foresight brings victory. Come here, follow me. Follow me. If you dare. Okay, he's he dares, but uh, the game is not letting him reach me. Okay, so this is where we die probably because we're not we don't have the stamina to reach it, right? So let me find a way so that um we can reach some ground. Some. Okay, so I see it. I see what we have to do, I think. Okay. Go, 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 go. Okay, keep calm. You're gonna make it. Okay, so now that we're here, is there a way that we can actually reach a really, really, really high place? Hold on, actually heal real quick. And is there a way that you can actually reach a really high place so that you can glide all the way to the to the um, ship? Mm -hmm.
Okay. Okay, I see this ship. I just don't think we're able to reach it yet. But we'll be fine. We'll make it. I'm sure. Hopefully. I think so. I'm not so sure, though. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on. Mm -hmm. Go, there you go, rest. Actually, go up here and now rest. Mm -hmm. You gotta go all the way up. Pick this up and then here and here. Okay, there you go. Okay, Geo, Sigil, whatever. Is the you right there? Yeah, it is. I just happen to need the the um, thing for the, from the traveler, the the ability from the traveler. So hold on. Just what will we come? Okay, there you go. Party setup. I said party set up. Switch out. Okay, there you go. I want to help. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now the way is to go from here to there. We'll make it. We'll make it for sure. Come on, come on, come on. This is a hell of a ship, huh? And we're finally gonna, you know, get to meet Biru. Um, you know, in story, I guess. Mm -hmm. So now we drop. Hold on, there's a Geo somewhere. You're the traveler? What are you doing here? I'm looking for Beto. Beto. Uh, looking for the captain? Does she... Okay, hold on. Oh, there's someone over here. Tie this stowaway up and feed them to the fishes. What the hell? What's with all the ruckus? This troublemaker's knocking here. Said they're looking for... They're up for no good. I'll, I'll wager. I, and I thought that, that would deal, I would this, uh, I will deal with this with uh, without Beto. Right, stop care scaring people. Uh, any old how... Our Captain Beto, Beto, uh, let's go you upside down. Uh, okay. I like to go to Inazuma. You want to go to Inazuma by ship. You'd best see the captain herself. That's what I'm trying to do. And I'm trying to activate the cutscene. So could you please like, let me know? Okay, thank you. What? First of all, let's get some that, you know, we're, you know, we're stealing from pirates. Let's go. Second of all, there's so many people to talk to. What is this? 
No help with anything? I, you're trying to rob me? I just did, actually, interestingly enough. Uh, you aren't part of the crew? Yeah, need help with anything? You should leave, okay. Thank you. Talk to C Drake, talk to, to anybody, really, huh? No, C Drake, you were here. Yo! Are you gonna rap? Said that you're a lesbian girl, me too. Hello. Did it help with anything? Yeah, blah, blah. Otherwise, uh, okay. So good. I'll talk to the whole crew. I don't care. As long as they don't make me, like, have to do anything, really. Okay, we keep still in food and provisions. Uh, okay. So you are asking me something, huh? I got you covered. Damn it, I thought that you would not make me do anything. Sure did. Uh, okay, I, I, I did it. I don't remember exactly uh, what was it, but alright, we got it. Get the present to Chang Chang. Oh, hell no, okay. Anybody else? Apparently everybody, huh? Ah, damn it. Okay, leave it to me. Keep the letter to the lie. Okay, who else needs help? Oh, I need to go all the way there, huh? Okay. Come on, come on, make it. Carefully. Mmm, don't know if I'll make it. Probably not. Hold on. Yeah, we need to take a breather. Oh, we should do so here. Here, here, here. Okay. That was a good decision. Keep going up. Mm -hmm. And now here, I have no idea how to get up. Hold on. How did you find this quest? Uh, I just went ahead and did the, the main one. Uh, I picked it up. I don't know. It told me that, that I needed to come to Beiru, to Beiru uh, which I'm just finding out that I've been pronouncing wrong. Okay, there you go. Yo, my dude. Need help with anything? Really? Nothing? Okay, so I came up here for nothing. Um, yeah, I need to do it for the Archon Quest. In order to reach Inazuma, we need help from Biru. Beiru, god damn it. Hello, Yusa. Oh, you need... Okay, allow me... Oh, there's Biru! <sighs> hmm. Who have we got here? Wait, I know you. Uh. You're the traveler, aren't you? The one who fought against the Fatui and Osile. Right? Yeah, we are. Uh, have, my, <laughs> have we met? <laughs> Ningguang told me about you. A traveler of great insight and remarkable skill has saved Liyue. Yo, said. let's go. She's a hard one to please, so praise from her is high praise indeed. I remember thinking at the time that it'd be good to meet you in person. Judging by the clothes on your back and this floating thing, <laughs> I guess that time has come. This floating thing. Hey, the name's not floating thing, it's Paimon! 
Paimon. Hmm. Who the hell are you two? Fascinating being. I know Beidou. You two give off not only the essence of wind and earth, but also of... Yes. The stars. Hmm. Huh? The fragrance of what now? That's the weirdest compliment Paimon's ever heard. Pay it no heed. I mean only to say I am certain that it is by fate, not chance alone, that we should meet. And that gives our encounter meaning. And this must be your bar for hire? Uh, I prefer other means of entertainment. Yeah, but... This young man is Kaidahara Kazuha. A Kazuha. temporary addition to my crew for reasons I won't bore you with. Occasionally he opens his mouth and flowers come out instead of words. <laughs> with this fine ship and the soft oh, no. breeze... Would it not be romantically irresponsible of me not to acknowledge Best character in the game, I agree. Poetry? <laughs> no, I can't argue with that. Okay, then. Once the clash is underway, I'll give you a chance to perform. I like that description, though. I think I might use course. it. Sometimes poetry he opens his mouth and, and flowers come out instead. Hey, you don't want to pass this opportunity up too easily. Especially seeing as our great hero here might be in attendance. Oh, wait a minute. What's the clash? Uh, also, just to clarify, by great hero, do you mean... Us, yeah. Uh -huh. Me, specifically, and, and you up. are, you know, my, ma my emergency food. The Crux Clash is a martial arts tournament that I hold. There'll be a whole bunch of folks taking part to showcase their talents. There are two important rules. One... Competitors must be renowned fighters. We want those with real martial arts ability, not just people taking part for the fun of it. Okay. So, you've got nothing to worry about there? I don't think there's anyone out there who hasn't heard of you. I mean, if we Two, have to fight somebody, you that's take cool. Part if you've got a vision. Otherwise, things get a little one-sided. Uh, uh, yeah, but the problem is I, I don't have a vision, but I can control elements, so yeah. <laughs> you must be feeling confident, but you might want to watch out. There are a few crouching tigers and hidden dragons lurking around in Liyue. Hmm. And with Liyue's savior taking part in the tournament, now that's going to turn a few heads. I think we can expect a healthy turnout this time. But we didn't come here to take part in a martial arts tournament. True. Well, before you dismiss the idea completely, you might be interested to hear that the prize this time around is particularly sought out. I mean, we can participate, but I, I would also it's like masterless to... masterless vision. Supplied by myself. As a matter of fact, if the tournament champion can reawaken that vision, it belongs to them. Yo, that's Is cool. There really such thing as a masterless vision? Okay, some people. So normal people can get a vision. Should they? Oh, I see that Kazuha is is an animal character. He has an animal vision right there. Uh, so you can get a vision if you earn it uh, somehow, some way. Apparently, they, they did surprise, huh? When a vision bearer dies, oh, the light shit. in their vision will fade away. But the shell that housed that light remains. As for whether this shell has any practical application, well, this remains to be seen. Hmm. But my intuition tells me that while it remains in the world, it may just be possible for someone else to inherit it. Yep, and the way I see it, a vision is a badge of recognition from the gods. So if anyone's able to rekindle it, it's got to be an individual of exceptional strength and talent. Organizing we don't the need it, that's the thing, no. Uncovering hidden talents. And hopefully this time, getting a vision to glow again. So if you don't have a vision, this is the perfect opportunity to get your hands on one of your very own. A vision is no use for me. Yeah, we're interested in getting to Inazuma, not fighting in some tournament. Inazuma? You want to go there? Yeah. Well, why didn't you say so? Inazuma, no sweat. In that case, if you win the tournament, I'll give you a choice. Mm. Masterless vision or a ticket to Inazuma aboard the Alcor. Up to you. Okay, that was easy. It's gonna be easy for us, huh? tournament! <laughs> What's wrong with that? The more talent we have, the better the tournament will be. I couldn't let a competitor like you fall through the net. What are we gonna do? <sighs> Looks like we pretty much have to do this tournament if we want to get to Inazuma. I'm not even worried, dude. <laughs> Great. Then let's get you signed up. Head to the tournament arena in Guyun Stone Forest. Kazuha and I will be over soon. It seems like it will only be a matter of time before the answer is revealed. 
All right. I don't know why Bi Paimon is always so so worried, huh? I also see a uh, a Geo. Ah, uh, supposedly just don't see where. Oh, I see it. Fuck, we have to go all the way up. Give to three portions of meat to to juice as well. Jeez, what is this fucking quest? Yeah, we don't have to do it in order to participate in like you know to, to do the rest. Uh, I can see it. Oh, I see the dude. Okay, hold on. I can complete this. Yeah, there you go. Give it. There you go. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna get uh, the geo that we need. Before I forget to do so. But yeah. Um, so Beto wants us to Beto, god damn it, something along those lines because uh, I've been pronouncing the name wrong, but whatever. Um, wants us to participate in the tournament essentially. Uh, she can take us to Inazuma without an issue. I'm guessing that the problem is gonna be like, you know, getting in. Rest. But yeah, all right. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We'll make it. It, it will just be uh, close, but we'll make it. Rest now. Go up. All clear as far as the eye can see. Oh, I've been here before. Uh, and then go up. Okay. All right. This seems like a place to, of good luck. You can do a wish real quick. Yo, it was a place of good luck. <laughs> that is so fucking fitting, though. That is incredible. Uh, of course we got Piru on her ship, right at the top of her ship. That is, that is a really, really cool place to get it. That is a really cool place to get it. Uh, I was, I was very, very, very lucky to do so. But something told me that that was going to happen. I don't know why. I was like, you know, fuck it. It'll be fun. It makes so much sense. Uh, Constellation and you, there you go. When storm breaking is used, creates a shield that absorbs up to 16% of Beta's max HP for 15 seconds. The shield absorbs electro damage 250% more, more effectively. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. More reasons to use her is just the fact that the team right now is really, really good. Um, but we can go ahead and use her, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, that is good. That is fantastic. What do we need to send you, by the way? Uh, only these things. And then we're done, huh? Ready. And then we can continue and, and I send you to level 50. Um, hmm. Okay, that is cool. That is cool. That is cool. We have to remember that. Uh, but fantastic. Okay, we got Beidou. We got Beidou. Uh, Beidou and then so on. All right. So we can, oh, we can almost ascend you. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. 